You survived Thanksgiving and now it's time to move on to the holiday season. Whether it's ice skating or building a snowman, there definitely is a right and wrong way on how to survive your holiday break. In a high school full of caring individuals, great teachers, and awesome school lunches, Alyssa, that's me, Jordan, that's me, and, and that's, that's us. And we have created a guide that'll help you survive school. And we're here to help you do it the right way. As the temperatures drop, make sure you keep your spirits up. And that chilly walk from third lot isn't going to get any warmer by complaining. So how will you survive it? You need to bundle up. But with our tips, you can be the hottest marshmallow in town. You can't go wrong with pea coats, scarves, or fuzzy socks. Not only will they keep you warm, but they're perfect for any occasion. The most important thing about surviving this season is keeping your tootsies warm. If you hit the streets of Mason with this attire, you will not only stay warm, but look fab while doing it. But this attire isn't only restricted to the streets of Mason, it's perfect for ice skating too! Wear your beanie and your mittens while you're skating, and the cuteness of your outfit might distract other skaters from the fact that you're sliding on your face more than you're skating on your feet. And if you fall, which you will, at least you're doing it in style. The next most important thing to do on your holiday break is to raid your grandma's closet for the ugliest Christmas sweater MHS has ever seen. And if your grandma was trendy, unlikely, Walmart is the place to be. Whether you're making Christmas cookies or going to a holiday party, ugly sweaters are the perfect way to jazz up your holiday season. And after you mess up those Christmas cookies, Walmart once again is the place to be. Or, you could not even attempt to make them the first time and just wear your sweater to Walmart and pick up a few batches and impress your family with the cookies that you made. Downtown has a lot to offer, including the Festival of Lights at the Zoo. It's a perfect hangout spot for you and Waldo Wears, not to mention it's a perfect excuse for missing out on family game night. If your spirit needs a holiday pick-me-up, Starbucks has got your back. Set aside the pumpkin spice latte because the peppermint mocha is coming through. Not only will this candy cane coffee fill your heart with holiday joy, but it'll also give you enough energy to do all of these activities again tomorrow. So again from the top, coats, scarves, and fuzzy socks will keep you warm and will also still keep heads turning. Take your squad out to the rink. Expect to fall, but at least you'll do it in style. You make cookies every year for your fam. Well, maybe Walmart makes them, but your family doesn't have to know. You know where to find that ugly sweater. Hopefully Grandma's house isn't too far away. And if your holiday spirit is lacking, Starbucks can ignite your holiday joy with a peppermint mocha latte. So, there you have it folks. You've been taught how to survive this holiday season by bundling up, participating in holiday festivities, and keeping your Christmas spirits up to the maximum. Be sure to check out our Twitters and let us know what you'd like us to classify. Thank you for tuning in to this edition of Jordan and Alyssa's MHS Survival Guide.